I think that doing it on your own is a bit of a myth. I've worked hard every day since starting this thing, but I did not do it alone. I hear it a lot where people just say, you just can't find good help. And I want to say, like, in no uncertain terms, that has not been my experience. Like, we have such a good team of people that could do any number of other things and choose to work here. I think people that can see a business apart from just the profit and loss statement to say, okay, what's the actual heart here? Is this business owner someone that we can get behind even if maybe they need some guidance? I think for the first several years, I was so heads down on my own business that it was really isolating. And the moment that I was able to say, okay, like I need to look up and I need to like, see what other people are doing too, uh, it felt like we were kind of in it together. We hope that we're partnering with a lot more other shops. That's really where our focus is right now on Wholesale Coffee, to say we think other people for the most part know their neighborhoods and communities best and we can come alongside them and help them serve really good coffee with confidence. The next step was with First National Bank and so I remember um, getting ready to open our Benson location. That was kind of the next big gulp when we realized that we needed some extra funding to make that happen. And I still wasn't much older and still hadn't owned a house for 10 years, but, uh, but First National said, you know what, we actually have a community development department. And so somebody that was willing to, to work harder for that, I feel like I got a lot of easy no's from other banks and got a, a hard yes from them. And so I really appreciated people that were willing to, to try. People ask me sometimes, you know, you could do other things, like why this? It feels like it feels like it hurts more. Uh, and it, it does, but I think that the trick is that the wins also feel so much bigger when it's something that, that you get to be a part of and that you get to do with people that um, you hire and are closest to. Small business is not for the faint of heart, but it's, uh, it's really rewarding. I don't know if you get to position yourself as a leader, you know, like I think that you just get to walk and if people happen to be following you, then I think they're the ones that get to call you that.